Okay, so you said this over about Stockinox. They're really making a name for themselves in the food world, huh? It's pretty impressive. Yeah. 80,000 Facebook likes, that's crazy for kitchen equipment. Yeah, what is it about them? It's got to be more than just selling ovens and refrigerators, right? <laughs> right. They've tapped into something kind of special, I think. It's like they're not just selling equipment. They're selling this whole vision, you know? Yeah. For, like, culinary success. Okay, I see what you mean. Yeah. Like, their website, it mentions the right quality at the best price. Mm -hmm. Is that part of it? It's huge. By focusing on value and really what the customer actually needs, they're not just attracting one type of business. They've got these seasoned pros, but also those startups just getting off the ground. And, I mean, have you seen their Google reviews? What is it, like 4.8 stars? Exactly. It shows they actually care, you know? Yeah, totally. It's like they understand that starting a food business is hard. You need equipment that can keep up but doesn't cost a fortune. Speaking of which, their custom stains of steel stuff. That's really cool. Who are they making that for? Imagine this. You're working in this tiny little kitchen, barely room to breathe, let alone cook. Stock and ox comes in, builds you a workbench, sinks, storage, maybe even a cutting board built right in. Oh, wow. All custom made to fit the space. Exactly. That's amazing. But it's not just individual kitchens, is it? They work with some bigger names too, right? You're right. They're dealers for Inomac and Venix. Oh, yeah. Those are big names. Okay, so for those of us who don't know, who are they? Okay, so Inomac, they're like the veterans. They were founded in 1976, and they specialize in professional refrigeration. Okay. Started small in Athens, and now they've got this huge production facility near the Athens airport. But here's the thing. They've stuck to their roots. They focus on making energy-efficient refrigerators that meet all the top European standards. So they're not just building refrigerators, they're building a legacy then. Exactly. I bet that's a big deal for businesses now, caring about their footprint. You okay, what about Venix? They seem a little more, I don't know, stylish. Yes. If Enomac is the seasoned veteran, Venix is like the passionate newcomer. They were founded in 2013, and they're all about bringing Italian design and craftsmanship to professional kitchens. I like it. They're known for their ovens and blast chillers, and get this, they even give their products names like San Marco and Rialto. Oh, very elegant. I'm picturing sleek lines. Yeah. Maybe a little Venetian glass blowing inspiration. You got it. They're all about combining high performance with a really stylish look, and they've already made it into over 90 countries. Wow. In just a few years. That's incredible. They're really taking off. So they're young, they're ambitious, clearly making a name for themselves. But what does it mean for Stockinox to partner with these two very different companies? It's like they've handpicked the best of the best and put it all in one place. Right. Whether you need Enomax energy efficiency or you're going for Venix's style, Stockinox can help you figure it out. It's like they're saying, we did the homework so you don't have to. You know what this reminds me of? What's that? My old refrigerator. It was so old and loud. Probably cost a fortune to run. Oof, I can imagine. Seriously, I wish I'd known about Inomac back then. But it's more than just saving money, right? Right. It's about making responsible choices for your business, for the planet. It's that bigger picture thinking. And that's where Inomac's values are really cool, I think. They talk about integrity and really caring about the customer. It makes sense. It's not just about making a sale. It's about doing business the right way. Which fits perfectly with what we're seeing from Stockinox. Okay, so back to Venice for a sec. You mentioned they draw inspiration from Venice, but is that really reflected in their products? I mean, besides the names. Oh, absolutely. Think about Venice, this city known for beauty and art and its connection to the world. Okay, yeah. That's what Venice puts into their designs, their ovens, their blast chillers. They're not just functional, they're beautiful. It's like this attention to detail you don't always see. They're like works of art themselves, then. Exactly. And they're not all looks, either. Venix is known for their technology. Their stuff is top-notch, both in how it looks and what it can do. It sounds like Stock and Ox has a real talent for finding these gems, these companies that are really pushing the boundaries of what's possible in a professional kitchen. For sure. Speaking of exploring, you mentioned Stock and Ox is going to be at some big trade shows. Yes, MDF Expo and Expatroff. Tell me everything. What can we expect? Okay, so MDF Expo. It's huge. It's all about meat, dairy, and frozen food. You'll see the whole process from how it's made to how it ends up in stores. I can already tell and get a million questions. So Stock and Ox <laughs> will be there showing off how their equipment fits in. Definitely. It's a chance for them to connect with businesses that need these really specialized solutions, like 
for keeping those ingredients fresh. Inomax refrigerators are perfect for that. Totally. It's like they're saying, we understand your unique challenges and we've got the tools to help. But it's not all industrial scale stuff, right? Mm -hmm. What about this Expatroph event? Oh, Expatroph is completely different. This is all about gourmet artisanal food. Okay, now you're speaking my language. Right. Imagine rows of amazing cheeses, incredible olive oils, chocolates made by hand. It's a food lover's dream. This sounds amazing. And it seems like the perfect place for Stockinox to connect with a different type of food business. Those smaller, more specialized businesses. You know what? I can already picture myself there. Getting lost among all those passionate food artisans. This is right up your alley too, huh? Oh, totally. But it's not just about the delicious food. Stockinox gets it, you know? These artisans, these culinary artists, they need equipment that's just as good as what they're creating. They need tools that match their passion. Exactly. And Stockinox is there to support them every step of the way. It's like they're saying, we see how hard you work, how much you care, and we want to give you the tools to succeed. 100%. It's more than just a business transaction. It's about being part of this community of food lovers. That's what I'm picking up on, yeah. And being present at both MDF Expo and Expatrof, that's huge. It shows how adaptable they are. They get the large-scale stuff, and e the small batch, artisanal world. It's pretty remarkable. So for anyone listening, anyone who's maybe intimidated by the idea of starting their own food business or even just wants to up their game in the kitchen, this is pretty inspiring, right? It is. It's like Stockinox is saying, we understand the challenges, but you don't have to do it alone. And the best part is they're so approachable. They're just a phone call away. You can tell they really value that personal connection. So to wrap things up, I think we've learned that Stockinox is much more than just an equipment supplier. Right. They're all about passion, about quality, and about supporting everyone who shares their love for food. It's about realizing that having the right equipment can really make a difference, and having the right partner can make all the difference. It really feels like there's a place for everyone in the culinary world. And with the right support, anyone can make their dreams a reality. Well, on that note, I think it's time to say bon appétit to this deep dive into the world of Stock and Ox. We hope you learned a lot and feel inspired to get in the kitchen. Until next time, happy cooking.